Hi, everybody. Happy Christmas Eve. I just wanted to come on today and share a few Christmas cards that I received um, that I didn't get before my last video. Um, and I just want to do a few hauls. Um, I've been shopping for Christmas, of course, and I've picked up a few things for myself and, you know, some things on clearance and, you know, crafty things. Um, I just got back from my parents. We had dinner. They made dinner today uh, for me and stuff, too, because I have to work Christmas tomorrow. Um, sorry. Yeah, the roads are kind of bad. They, you know, they keep saying flurries and stuff, but then, you know, there's like, you know, sheets of ice and on the road and all this stuff and the plows are out. I'm like, well, something, you know, someone's not telling the newsmen and stuff that, and there's already an inch of snow and everything, but I'm like, I don't think the plows are out sanding and salting for nothing, but then the news and stuff is in, even on, um, Alexa, she's just saying snow flurries and stuff. It's like, well, someone's not telling them the plow men that they're not supposed to be out. So I'm like, I don't think the plows are going to go out wasting salt and sand and um, plowing the roads if, you know. <laughs> but anyways, um, so yeah, I oh, just lost my slipper. So I just want to show you these cards. Um, this beautiful card here. It's the most wonderful time of the year. This is from Deb Hawk. Merry Christmas, David, and Happy New Year, too. <laughs> this one is from Sandy Cole. Merry Christmas from Sandy. Um, this one is from Joanne Groban. Um, I love this. Crafty Hugs. And this one is from the lovely, the lovely, lovely. <laughs> Pat Crispel. And she included these vintage um, stickers. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, ladies. Um, so, yeah, we'll get to this haul. I actually stopped a dollar uh, general um, on my way home. I was, I've been looking for a little white Christmas tree. I'll show you why. I went to Michael's um, the other day, and I picked up some cute little ornaments on their miniature set. Um, you know, they've had the Christmas stuff. I think it's, is it 60% off or 70% off? I think it's 70% off. Um, I didn't really need any ornaments, but I found these ones and I just thought they were so cute. So I just want to get like a two foot or two and a half foot tree, you know, white ones with the lights already on it. And I just can't find one anywhere. So it's not like I need it today, but I was like, I was going to get one. But anyways, so I went to Dollar General. And um, they didn't have one there. They were sold out and stuff. But they actually have some Valentine stuff out. Like, the, you know, they have a roll of, you know, Valentine stuff out. They'll probably get more stickers and stuff in. But um, I was kind of like, okay. Um, but I went and um, bought the stuff anyways. <laughs> you know, because like the Dollar Tree, if you don't buy it, you don't get it. Um, so I went and bought. Um, these aren't really Valentine's. I went over to their craft section. I just bought some bigger pearls. Sometimes you want some bigger pearls. 
uh, for projects or to, if you're making bigger flowers to, you know, I like to put a little center in. So I picked up those and I thought these were cute. I think I bought some of these before. Um, I can't remember. I know people have sent me a couple, like in pocket letters or whatever. I just thought they were cute. I like the little green ones, so I picked up these. These are both, you know, in the dollar ones. Uh, you get 12, so I picked up another one of those. Um, and let me know in the comments if you guys can guess who these are. Uh, or guess who they are. Guess who they're going to be for. Um, I actually had thought they were all, they had four of them. I actually had thought the rest of these are all a dollar too, which I was kind of surprised. Um, I had thought all four of these were the same, so I picked up, I picked just one. I'm like, oh, I'm just going to buy one, you know, for this person. Um, and then, you know, sometimes you go back, you're like, maybe I missed something, you know, like us with, we're just kind of sticker freaks and stuff. So I'm like, maybe I missed something. So I, you know, I've circled around and went to look at the Christmas stuff and, you know, whatever. So I circled around back to the Valentine stuff and I went through these again and I actually noticed that um, there was two different designs. There's the unicorn. They're actually little uh, make your own pinatas. There's a unicorn. Let me see if this light helps. It looked like it was too bright. I don't know if that helps or not, but let me know if you guys think these are going to go to. There's a unicorn, and then there's the pinata. It's a make your own llama. So I thought those were cute for a dollar. Then you get all the little, you know, stuff in the bag. Um, and then they had. Actually, let me do this. The stickers, too. They had... Um, I liked these ones. I like... Because I have some of these cupcake ones and the little heartfelt, but I liked the love. You get 16, so I think you get, like, 8 of the love. I like the love for pocket letters. So... And the little jewel... And they had these felt ones. You can poke out the little lock and key. That's a little lock lock there. Um, it's got the little, um, there's like a little robot. I don't really care about the robot. I mean, they're cute, but, but there's hearts and stuff. There's love in there. Some of these foam stickers I don't really care for because you can't really tell what they are. These ones are actually pretty good once you, like with some of them, like once you poke out. You know the centerpieces that they didn't do. You can tell, you can see what it is. But some of the, you guys know what I mean. Some of these foam stickers, like you can't really tell like what it is. But these ones are glitter. They actually had the ones that were non-glitter, and those ones are really. I, don't know, I just don't care for those. But then I saw these things, and I had to get them. You have to be careful with these because like the bottoms, they had like three or four of them. The bottoms. You know, there was nothing in them because they just fell out. The bottoms aren't exactly like this one. All the stuff fell out. I hope it's all there. Um, I had to put it back in. I actually have to tape it. Close because I don't know if I'm going to keep these myself or put them in friend mail or, you know, whatever. But for a dollar, I just thought they were cute. So I got the ones that they had. I think I got... I got one of each that they had, and then I got an extra one, and the other three that they had left were only the packaging, and there was nothing, there was none of the parts anywhere, so I don't know if they just fell in the box, and, you know, the employees just stuck up the, just stuck up, you know, the, these things on the shelf. <laughs> But they're these little make-your-own-animals. Uh, this one comes with a fox and a little lion. They're just felt. You know, and then he comes with the little pieces in the back. Um, this one is the... The, um... The little bear and the elephant. So I got two of those. And then there's the this one. This one comes with two owls and it has a little hanger. So there's the stuff for that one. And that's what the... Or no, you saw that one. That's what the stuff in the elephant looks like. So for a dollar, I was like... Like I said, it's like... Um, even if I kept these, which I might not... I might... Um, 
which one do I have two of? I'll probably put one of these, since I have two of them, into a friend mail. Or I might just give them all to, in friend mail. We'll see. I just thought they were too cute, so. Um, some of the stuff I don't really have in bags is just random. I just picked up this at Walmart last night. Some more white, plain white card stock. You can never have enough. Uh, um, I was able to get um, a trim and scoreboard at a, um, a this was $29.99 at Hobby Lobby. Um, I got this. I've been wanting one. You can make envelopes, cards, um, rosettes. Uh, what else? Boxes. Where does it tell you what you can make? Somewhere. Um, the only thing I don't like is that it doesn't give you the, like the instructions. I went to their website and it does show like where you can um, where there's videos, but it doesn't like you know like some places you know you can like print off. I couldn't see unless someone knows you know where there's a thing like where you can print off things maybe like instructions. This doesn't really give it you know. It, tells you like what you know trimming you know all that but it doesn't really give you instructions like how to make a box even if it just gave you like you know a, a five page booklet like how to you know make one box and then you can you know, learn how to resize it yourself to make a smaller or larger box um you know that's the only thing i don't like or how to do an envelope because you know it scores this opens up to be a 12 by i think it's 12 by 12 and then you just get the little you know the score more score thing with it you know, kind of like this. Um, I have it inside of it. So I, that was $29.99, and I used my 40% off coupon, so I think it was like $17.99. Um, so I finally got one of those, but I want to know how to actually use it. I did score to make a little booklet with it, but, you know, um, so. But, yeah, I wish it would have came with instructions. It's kind of weird that, you know. <laughs> Um, this stuff I got from Walmart. I think I got this. Um, this was on clearance. It's like a, what do they call it? Hanging decor. It's got streamers. I just thought it was so pretty for a dollar. It says, hello, summer. I don't know if I want to keep it for myself or just put it in front of mail, but for a dollar, I just grabbed it. I just thought it was cute. Um, and then there was this one too. This one says, um... Uh, Fiesta with the little donkey, you know, the same kind of streamer, and then I got, I've been picking up, when I see it on clearance, like really cheap, like you guys know I love yellow, um, I've been picking up some, I when I go to Walmart, because I know they do it there, um, Hobby Lobby, they'll do like their clearance, you know, like on fabrics that aren't really selling, or just remnants. Um, this was like a dollar sixteen, so I don't. I usually try to pay like a dollar something for like a big bunch of it or whatever. So I like this color only if I like the color because you guys know I got that sewing machine. I did try it, you know. I took it out of the box. It works. I haven't really done anything with it yet. I'm gonna. I want to try to. So I but I found this one. So I want to start with like little things. So you know, I'm not gonna go and buy you know expensive fabric until I actually you know. So I'm just gonna start making little like pillow animals or you know whatever like little stuffed kind of animal things. So I picked up this one for a dollar um, sixteen. Uh, I picked up my roommate actually says he knows how to. This is yeah, this is crochet. Cro I, so I picked up a crochet hook. He says he knows how to crochet. Uh, he says he, he does it left-handed, so I'm not, <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm right-handed, so, you know, he's left-handed. So I picked that up. I forgot about that. So I'm not sure if he's going to be able to teach me how to do it. If he's left-handed, I'm not sure how. If you guys, any of you guys crochet, or maybe I can learn it from YouTube. I don't know, because I've been wanting to do that and, um, and the um, knitting. Um, but I picked up this, Be Magical, the stamp. I picked up um, Thinking of You, Have Faith, Blessed by Our Friendship stamp. I thought those would be cute on cards or on the back, you know, just to stamp it or the inside. Um, and then I picked up this unicorn set, Follow Your Own Rainbow, and then the two unicorns. I thought that would be cute, probably in um, friend mail.
Um, I picked this up at Michael's. Um, I got my mom one too. Just kind of nostalgic. I actually do have a Barbie one from I think the 80s or something. Um, I remember they had G.I. Joe ones and all. I would love to find a G.I. Joe one and stuff like that. But these are the, what do they call these ones? Actually, that's in French. Okay. It's French. On, that's kind of cool. It's French on one side and then English on the other. Um, they call them, these are uh, create your own fashion plates. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys remember that or your kids had them. Where you take the different plates. You know, there's like 24 images to mix and match. Then you would take the crayon. So these were only $2 at Michael's. They were on sale. So I picked up one for my mom, one for me, even if I don't never use it. It's just kind of this nostalgia. Like I said, I do have an original from I got at the Christmas tree shop, or that's what we call it, the um, the Christmas or the Christmas the, um, church sale we go to. Um, so I picked up that. This is also from Michaels. Um, they do have their card stock on sale, so uh, their Christmas card stock. I was looking over in the because um, these say ten dollars, and you know sometimes they mark stuff up to you know, and then you go back, and I was looking at it in the shelf just to see how much the the card stuff or you know the, the envelopes and card sets were because you know sometimes they mark stuff up and then when it's on clearance but i looked and then I, it's actually a good deal so i paid it was three dollars for 50 cards and envelopes so i bought the white in white because it was 70 percent off the this is considered christmas even though it's in white um i got a set of the red 